the hitman is could be a conspiracy, but wherever they smoke this uh, 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 fire. We believe that this was not a normal robbery. The, the people were hired to do that, and if I comment on that, I will jeopardize the investigation. I'm confident that it won't take another six years and that uh, we will see this investigation moving forward. They will always go to Senzo, and they spoke to Senzo and presented their documents. More than six years after the death of soccer star Senzo Miyua, five men appear in court as the case is once again postponed to March 2021. According to lobby group AfriForum, who were appointed by the family, the mastermind remains at large. We are very disappointed because that's what we came here for. We thought that we are going to see the mastermind. We disappointed, we certainly disappointed. I said so last time, I reiterated. Last time I thought that we had enough to um, arrest the mastermind and, and bring the mastermind before court. But what I can reveal is I've been briefed by the police, I've had contact with the NPA. As I stand here, we have more evidence against the mastermind than we had last time. That's a fact. But how did we get here? According to witness testimony, Mayewa was gunned down during a scuffle after five men broke into his girlfriend, Kelly Kumalo's Fosloris home. But the person who got him into that vehicle to save his life was Kelly Kumalo. That is the reality. Those are the facts. Police recovered bullet fragments, a beanie, a glove, and a dreadlock, ripped off in an apparent struggle. A 250,000 rand reward is announced by then Police Commissioner Ria Piecha for any information. The case then appeared to have its first breakthrough. we will find them as we will find them every day we will never rest up until we find all of them well i think in the in the first place um, i think the right investigation team was not appointed and i think that's a problem in our in our criminal justice system there is no sufficient evidential material to put mr mbata to trial Consequently, this court orders the immediate release of the accused Zamagutle innocent butter from detention. Even there, I mean, there was a wrongful arrest. So, uh, the Minister of Police was sued, what is it, how much was it? Uh, 17 million? A legal battle involving Zamakule Mbata is still going on over his wrongful and unlawful arrest and detention, malicious prosecution and defamation. Between 2015 and 2019, the case seemingly went cold. Police ministers change and renewed promises are made. In an interview on ENCA's Crime Watch on January 9, 2019, Police Minister Becky Trele promised swift progress. The entire family as well took a serious strain, uh, the mother and everybody around. With the uh, Afri Forum on board, we are, we are convinced and uh, we are sure that they can help us to solve this, uh, this issue. And then we are all looking forward to some level of closure, you know, because that's going to put the whole family at rest. Yes, there is ample evidence to show that these people are paid killers um, that work mostly in the, also in the taxi industry. Um, so that is on the one hand is an indication. Um, they're not people that, that are going to just go there to steal a few cell phones. They are people that get paid uh, to assassinate the people. 
Police then arrest Banya Stallwater employee Bongani Ntanzi. Three days later, Ntanzi allegedly gives a signed confession before a magistrate implicating the shooter. The lead shooter, serving a 30-year sentence for a 2015 taxi-related murder, gives police a signed confession from his Johannesburg prison cell. According to sources close to the investigation, the same 9mm pistol to kill Muyiwa was used in the 2015 murder. Well, I think it raise, certainly raises question marks because the forensic evidence shows it was indeed a 9mm pistol that was used and not a revolver. And it raises question marks with regard to uh, statements of people. If there are more than one individual that's going to be uh, conducting a robbery, you can't expect, well, I would just use my observation and suggest you can't expect there to be one weapon. A leaked document which the NPA says was an innocent mishap claims there are links between Kelly Kamala and one of the accused. The leaked document once again is just part of that process of meddling interferences. If the person was in the house, then she would know the person that she saw in the house. So she would know the person from the incident. So that kind of a question, to, if you're asking to what extent does she have knowledge of the person? As the case continues, the NPA has said they cannot rule out further arrests. While one family waits for closure, new wounds have been opened for those closest to suspects. Okay. The matter has been postponed to the 5th of March 2021. Well, I think the, the right people are arrested now, but not all of the right people. So they there needs to be more arrests. Um, of course, from our side, we cannot prosecute as before the NPI does this, has not decided not to prosecute. If Ms. Kamala is called in to testify as a witness, she will do so. 